At the 1962 Detroit Auto Show, the 1963 cars were introduced, and those were the cars that sold more than any in history to that point. Detroit was booming in the auto industry in 1963. They were selling larger cars again. They'd gone through a small period where they were trying out compacts, but the industry was feeling its oats at that point, and they were really sort of getting more chrome, more aluminum. The whole works was going into Detroit in 1963. The Ford Mustang was really the car of the 60s in so many ways. It was sleek and sexy and was designed to be the car for young America. It was finally unveiled in 1964 at the New York World's Fair and was an enormous sensation. It sold more cars in the first months than any car that Ford had ever put out before then. It was the largest marketing campaign in automobile history to that point, led by J. Walter Thompson and its uh, Mad Men in Detroit. They had a secret office in Detroit that they called the Tomb, where they developed the marketing uh, techniques that really sold the Mustang uh, to the world. 